What's up, everybody? Darkness Blaze 19 here. Welcome, y'all, to another Need for Speed Pro Street video. I had a bit of a surprise for y'all. Y'all see when the match starts up. I am also on steering wheel and pedals. I got the steering wheel and pedals set up right, so we're gonna be able to drift, drive perfectly. Yes, we're on the 240, but y'all are gonna recognize this. I just got them doing this. <laughs> back where it started. I don't know if I'm going to be able to drift this. Yeah, drifting this corner isn't easy. Especially not that one. There we go. Whew, gotta get a drink of my root beer, my soda. Also got the pedals working, so you're going to hear the pedals hit clicking. Sometimes. I don't, I don't not know why it does that. This camera just don't focus on some games. I don't get that. That is so sloppy that I need to reset that. It's hard to drift this corner with a car that, ain't, that doesn't get no speed fast enough at the start. Yeah, I'm not scared that full throttle of this car. 3,000, let's go. I still don't have a shift through yet, so I might be struggling to shift cars. I don't get the right steering wheel for this game to be able to shift and stuff. I will soon, I promise. I probably will be switching out the steering wheel that I got. I didn't turn my sensitivity up on my steering wheel. I'll show you what, what I mean, but I mean at the, near the end of it. It was still that first place, though. Even though it's giving a bit of an attitude, but other than that, it's doing pretty well. Oh, and uh, be prepared for more mower videos coming up. Because I almost got a certain engine finished. Let's go to the T40. 
I'd show you on my Supra, but I still ain't got the shifter deal fixed up yet. So I can't do those two. But for right now, I can do speed challenges and stuff. Uh, we got first in that one. Let's do this one. Get it out of the way. We're going to use the same 240 again. I got two different 240s. One's actually tuned to do this stuff. And the other one is the one that I just got them building. Which is my iconic Nissan 240SX. Which is a beast when it comes to getting around corners. Oh, don't worry. Just watch what happens when it gets some speed. Crap, I forgot to set the steering. Turn it up a notch. Perfect. There we go. Now we shouldn't have any issues. Let's get it. Crap. Maybe. Six thousand. Let's go. This thing is really scooting up now. Send up another notch. I think this is my third level of drifting. Might do maybe a speed challenge and a grip challenge. Then I'll be done. Maybe. I just not sure. This game's pretty easy on steering wheel, letting you know that right now, literally. I ain't got the music on because I'm not trying to get copyrighted. Let off. Let off again. Hold that e brake. Now we just let her rip. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, and maybe our first run was a little bit better with the steering. Yeah, at the second level, that works a little bit better. Actually, I'm not even sure what car I'm even using, which might be a slight issue. Like my, my speed and my grip car. It sucks I can't shift, which is very annoying. Hey. Woo! Almost 7,000, y'all. Let's go. I'm getting better with the steering wheel. On this game, you really ain't got to try with the steering wheel. You can just turn into a drift. This thing drifts really well. Yeah, killing it. This thing drifts. Rio's easy. Ooh, we are using Evo, y'all. A car that actually stays straight on the road. Really good thing. Wish this game still played online, dude. Because if this game is still played online, I'll probably be beating everyone. <sighs> with controller, not steering wheel. I'm better with controller, not steering wheel. And my carbon. Guys, I'm sorry. That, that game just ran out of me. Quit working. Man, I think this thing matched. We'll find out when on the tip. Yep. Wait, what am I talking about? All oh, my cars are probably maxed. Oh, you think American cars? Stay out of the way. 
Should I turn the sensitivity down on my steering wheel? Crap. What's my NOS? Oh, there it is. It's... I'm probably gonna lose because this car don't have much speed in it. I keep forgetting to tune my gear ratio on this car. Crap. Crap. After this, I'll tune my gear ratio. Oh, at least I came in second. Okay. We need to get a little bit more gear out of it. A lot more speed. Way more speed. <sighs> Let me fix that. And I'm going to go probably redo that race after I go do the grip. Let's just set my gear ratio up on this Evo real quick. Sixth gear is what's giving the issue. Oops, too far. We need a tall sixth gear. Final gear ratio. Let's find out what she'll do. I think I went too far. I am going to be using the Nissan GTR. Don't really like it much, but let's go. Don't mind that I turned the TV up. I had no choice. Let's get this last race out of here, and I really do have to. Great! What up? Why is this car going to drift all of a sudden? There's literally zero force feedback in this game, but it's still doing that. this. Let's go, y'all. Okay. Check why my steering wheel's uh, settings are up, but they're not. I like how this older game, they got it set up to where when you drive through a tunnel, you can literally hear the car revving up. I got this. This is going to be the last race. If you can't tell what I'm doing, I am letting off the gas for the corner. I'm almost uh, caught up with them. So all I got to do is just full on send this car. Got this, yo. Not if the car does that. 
That was my mistake. If I didn't wreck, I probably would have beat that record there. Literally. Wish the steering wheel did a full 360. Maybe I wouldn't have this much issues. This game's old, so it might cut out every now and then. This is... Okay, I should have grabbed the R34. Second. At least we got a second. I keep grabbing the crappy cars. Well, that's the end of the video. I hope you all enjoy.